I burnt my toast. But I'm one of those people where it's like, if I burnt it, I'm still eating it. Morning, guys. <sighs> so, so confused on where I left off with you guys because I realized my vlog was like at a stupid length, like too long. So I had to like find a place to cut it off. Whatever. Y'all don't care about the the sauce behind it. Um so I told you guys in my last vlog, and I remember this because I just finished editing it, that the bathroom was done and I was gonna show it to you guys, but sheesh. I need something to open this with. Hold on. A couple little changes I gotta make. So, man, I made some serious mistakes, y'all. So, I wanted a curved tub. We know that. But I went with one significantly cheaper than all the rest. Ugh. And I wish I hadn't done that because now I'm seeing the reviews where they're saying that the tub makes this creaking noise. I've never bought an acrylic tub. This one's acrylic. It makes a creaking noise and the only way to stop it is for it to be super, super, super supported. And mine just supported, but it wasn't like extra support. So I'm probably going to have to like go back in in some kind of way add more support under this. I don't know, child. I'm going to have my contractor look at it, but um, I also need a change. I'm changing I have changed the drain on my tub three times, okay, three times. This will be the last time. So I originally had the kind with the lever where you, when you want to fill up the tub, you hit the lever. I don't want that anymore because that's what happened with my last tub. If that lever or that breaks, you have to pull everything out and get it all redone because the because of where the pipe is or you have to go to the closet it's a whole big thing so i'm going to get a different kind that is this kind where you actually push the drain down so this is it says push it's like this and you push it so um that way i don't have to have a lever one and then i'm going to switch out the little plate from the lever to just a plate and then these are the screws i won't be doing this even though i'm pretty sure my boyfriend is capable of it uh, my contractor said that he would come back and do it so this literally would take him two seconds and Matt Black is never in store, which was a problem because he switched it for me. But when he switched it, it was like a bronze nickel. And for those of you who don't know, I'm slightly colorblind. So things that are black or dark really stand out to me. So I could tell that the one he inserted was not 100% Matt Black. So it would bother me and catch my eye. So, the only matte black ones were like by mail. So, I had this delivered and I will just let him know that it's here and see what he thinks about the, the creaking. And I had to order a new thing to put my towels in because the one that I had is too wide. It takes away from the design of the curved tub. So I have to order that. I have it in my cart for Amazon, but I'm gonna I'm actually gonna wait until next week. And then I have to get all new curtains because the coloring of the bathroom is different from the coloring I had before. And now it's so much taller that the 72 by 72 no longer works because I have a curved 
tub so it's longer dimensions here and longer dimensions here so i have to get all new shower curtains um and then i have to get all new rugs my rugs were already headed out the door they were like done for it anyways but they're black and it takes away from the design of the floor with them being black it's a lot so yeah the bathroom is finished but still a lot to do um i think i told you guys that my housekeepers came they did a great job they cleaned up got all the dust and everything from everywhere they wiped everything down it took two of them took two of them that's how much like dust and stuff i had so just thrilled and elated that that is done <sighs> so i just been jumping and moving and jumping and moving and um Today is Saturday, so I'm going to, I just kind of like took my time, edited my video or whatever. Um, I'm going to get dressed now, kind of get, you know, you know, and leave the house for the day. That's what we're going to do. We're going to leave the house for the day and go from there. I told you guys that I had started taking these since Miami. Um... I don't think that I would feel anything with these necessarily. Um, I still think I prefer emergency only because emergency is like, to me, it's quick. I don't know which one's better um, for like your kidneys. I'm assuming the emergency would be better because vitamins can be hard on your kidneys. But I don't know. I guess it's just a matter of preference. Like if it's quicker for you to take one of these, I keep them on the kitchen counter, pop one of two of these in your mouth and go about your day. Or is it easier for you to be drinking your water bottle so you have this much water left, dump in your emergency and shoot it down? For me, the emergency is kind of quicker, but I'm remembering about the same. I don't know if that makes sense, but I probably will not rebuy those. I would probably rebuy the Ashwagandha and maybe I want to try them little nighttime ones for like nights when I'm just like really restless and my brain is just going. <sighs> we got a lot of ramble session this vlog, so I'm going to cut that out. <laughs> not cut, not cut that clip out, but I won't be rambling much. Oh, oh. And I don't know if I showed you guys these. I finally got my hands on these. Sparkling cranberries. They're 70 calories and like half the sugar of cranberry juice. They are so good. They are so good. So um, Target seems to be the only place that always has them in stock. So the good thing about Target is I could just do like a drive up. So that's probably what I'll do. But try them. Sounds a little freaky, but most death worth it. Hmm. And I gotta get my hair together. <laughs> but all right. Morning, peeps. Ooh, lighting. Okay. Morning, peeps. Um, it is Sunday, October the 2nd. I have to say the date because I'm realizing the date's not set in my camera. So when I import footage, I'll be struggling to put the date stamps, which is why you guys will get some vlogs that don't have the date stamps. Yeah, that's why. Because typically... If the date is set in your camera, your phone does it automatically. When you edit and you click to insert the time and day, it'll be accurate. But uh, no ma'am, no sir. So what I'm about to do right now is I'm going to make me some coffee. Let me show y'all. How can I show y'all my fit? My, my, my. So I have on this little number. Um, this is from Torrid. Gosh, I got to get my life together, guys. It's like a jumpsuit. It's like a denim jumpsuit. I don't know. Can you guys see better here? 
Nope, you can't. Let's go back here. Yeah, but it's like a denim jumpsuit that I got from Torrid. Um, surprisingly, it's like, I want to say a size six. But I like it being that way because even though it's way too big, it, it helps it fall the way I want it to fall, so. <laughs> so today's agenda. Today's agenda is I'm gonna go to West Elm and Home Goods. So just making my usual stoked coffee with some creme brulee. You know, I got mixed reviews on this. I love it, but a lot of people said it just tastes like caramel. But I've had strictly just the caramel and it didn't do it for me. So usually like the first three days of me cramping, if I have coffee, it makes my cramps significantly worse. But now I'm at the point where I can finally have coffee. Oh, so good. Oh, many week. Ah. So yeah, I've never been to West Elm, but I'm looking for particular things. I'm not, I just want like an 18 inch cabinet that's like, Maybe six feet tall Ugh, for linen storage. And I found one on Amazon. But, I don't want you guys there. But the issue with the one on Amazon is that it has to be built. And it's not exactly the color I want. So we'll see. But this lighting child is horrible. Horrible. So I will, oh, much better. I will holla at you guys once I get in the car. I just text my family to see if they're ready because I'm going with my sister and my mom. Um, they both have really good taste and they will also talk me off the ledge if I'm going to buy something not needed or whatever so man stoked it's so good all right y'all peace talk to you in a few it's only a case <laughs> it's such a pretty day it's such a pretty day outside, like, super. Oh, I hope there's no traffic. It's Sunday, so, but everybody likes to like, okay. Wow, ma'am had her, wow. It's not your place, Amber. It's not your place. This older woman with purple hair is walking up the hill with a walker with a button down shirt and no bra and the shirt is just completely open. And she's just, ma'am, is just jiggling everywhere. I guess the dogs don't like it either. It ain't my place. It ain't my place. But I want to turn around. But it ain't my place. She ain't look crazy. She ain't look discombobulated. Homegirl looked like she was just living her best life. So, ain't none of my business. 
right, y'all. I'm gonna turn this air on now, and uh, I will talk to y'all in a few. Morning, peeps. Ugh. I had a ton of Amazon packages at the door yesterday, and I was not feeling it. Okay, what is this? Oh, yeah. Okay, so I ordered hard copy of my sister's book. I have the ebook, but I um I wanted a paperback. I'm coming to the realization that in order for me to read, I need to have the physical book. So I will still get her books, like her ebooks, for like if I'm ever on a plane or somewhere like that, and I just want to quickly like read something. But I'm going to actually have to go through her catalog and get whatever books I don't have um, in paperback. So this was her last book before the one that's out now. Um, it's a standalone. So um, yeah, it's called Another College Love Story. This is probably by far one of my favorite covers that she has had and look i love how like the headers are let me try to find you some more Let's see so yeah excited about this um i'm also looking at a bookshelf because of course now the little four or five shelves I have are not. I never bought a bookshelf because I like most of the books I get are electronic. But like I said, I'm finding out that I am a real turn the page type chick. So <clears throat> then I had to buy all new rugs. My rugs were already on their last leg, but um, they also no longer match the bathroom so I can pull up the black ones they've done their they served their purpose and I don't know how I feel about this color but it was the only color that looked somewhat like it would match the bathroom so yeah and I got a much shorter bath mat the one I had before it took up the whole floor but now that my floors are so nice, I want to show them off. So, smaller mat. Here's hoping all this stuff matches. Is a little Coco Melon cell phone. Because she's at the age where she will, she doesn't know what a phone is, but she likes that it lights up and all that. So, we're gonna get her our own little what is this it says bath rug but that's what that is supposed to be Oh, this is the around <clears throat> the toilet rug. I know a lot of people feel different ways about this. They're like, oh, that's nasty. Just wash them frequently. But my feet have to sit on something. So I always have an around the toilet rug. This must be the toilet, the top of the toilet. 
because I don't like my um, toilet lid just being bare. So I know it's old school to some of y'all, but I don't like my lid not having to cover. And you shouldn't be leaving pee on your seat and all that to be worried about the lid cover getting stuff on it. Like, come on. Okay. Yeah. It is the toilet lid cover. So, um, yesterday came a shower curtain. It took me so long to find one that I thought went with the theme. I got it here. Don't like it. <laughs> it's pixelated and it looks cheap to me. But it's going to do for now because it's going to do for now. Um, Yeah, I should have went with my first mine and got the one out by Tommy Bahama. But So that's all I have for the packages. Today I'm just going to be cleaning the house, washing dishes, phone, doing laundry. And then editing. And then I have a hair appointment um, later that I will take you guys to. So it's going to be a pretty big time jump for today. Because most of the stuff I'm doing around the house, you guys aren't going to care about. It is the next day. I got my hair done yesterday. I tried um, tape-ins. And um, yeah, it's really light. It feels, you know... Like, nothing's there. Um, I got 18-inch hair and did not realize that my hair had grown so long that <clears throat> it's basically the length of the extensions. And that is so irritating because that means eventually I'm going to have to actually buy longer hair because at this point, the tape-ins look like what my hair would look like if I just got it pressed or just straightened so which is fine but not when you're paying it costs extra money like you can get a press and curl for 55 dollars you know 60 dollars you getting tape ins and that's my error by the way i picked my own length um me choosing that length and it being so close to the length of my hair it's it takes away the fun of you know whatever so it's super cute though it looks extremely natural i opted to get hair from my old hairstylist who's actually retiring and um i love her hair i've mentioned it before on this channel it's bravon and so she actually made me some tape ins so that's what i'm using and she's actually going to be selling these so i'm going to link them down below because um they are the hair even um, the girl doing my hair she said that the actual hair was really good um we did have to reinforce like the sticky part um but sometimes that just happens with tape-ins so um anywho um that's just what i want to tell you guys and i know i didn't show you <sighs> my hair but i will you guys will see it there's no way around it i'm not hiding it i just don't feel like unwrapping my hair right now and i'm about to make breakfast so what i figured i would do is i would make um i have this apple sage sausage um it's really good let me see oh i lied <laughs> My mom has the apple sage sausage at her house that she bought for me. I just know I saw it. Mine is the other one that I really like. It's Italian garlic and fennel. So I'm just going to cut up some of this sausage, put it in the skillet with some dinosaur kale. And um, just season it up really good and then just throw an egg in there. Um, and then I'll show you guys like the uh, finished products. I don't know that I can show you the process, but let's see. You can reciprocate. 
I got delicious taste, you need a woman's touch in a place Just protect her and keep her safe Baby, worship my hips and waist So feminine with grace, I touch your soul when you hear me say Boy, let me be a woman Let me be a woman Woman, I'm a motherfucker, but they got a problem Put some babies in your life and take away the drama Put the paper in the picture like a diorama Lot of face, a lot of people are the opposite Cause the world told me we ain't got the common sense Gotta prove it to myself that I'm on top of shit And you would never know a god without a goddess Is honest, is fucking honest, kidding I could be on everything I mean, I could be the leader, head of all the states I could smile and jiggle it, tell his pocket simply I could be the CEO, just like a Robin Fenty And I'ma be there for you, cause you on my team, girl Don't ever think you in hell of these niggas dream, girl They wanna pit us against each other each other when we succeed and for no reason they wanna see us end up like we were Gina or Mean Girl Princess or Queen, tomboy or King You've heard a lot you've never seen Mother Earth, Mother Mary, rise to the top Divine Feminine, I'm Feminine Woman, let me be a woman Woman, woman, woman I can be a woman Woman, woman, woman Let me be a woman Woman, woman, woman I can be a woman I burnt my toast, but I'm one of those people where it's like, if I burnt it, I'm still eating it. And that's my coffee. Bone apple tea. Alright guys, it's several hours later. I figured I would show you my hair. So these, these are the tapings mixed in with my real hair. Um, it looks very natural. Um... A lot of it has to do with the fact of the the hair. Cambodian hair just mixes in with mine. Um, and also that I didn't go like extreme on the length. Like, let me see. So, this is my length. And then the tape ends. My hair stops here. And the tape ends go like an inch or so more. So I'm going to experiment and get some longer ones to play with or whatever. But yeah, it's lightweight. It doesn't feel like there's anything um, in my head. It feels like just like a regular pressing curl. So I like it a lot. We will see how long it lasts because I do have a scalp condition. I have an overproduction of oil. My hair gets really oily. Um, so, typically my hair has to be washed like once a week. So, we'll see if these come a slide. Now, not due to the installation, but more so just due to my hair problems, hair concerns. But yeah, you can, um, put it up, as you can see, completely up in a ponytail you can wear it in a bun and it just completely what? as you can see side back you can't see anything and because it's tape it's bendable and all that other kind of stuff so yeah I just wanted to pop in and show you guys that I haven't been doing anything I just been chilling um, yeah, I've just been chilling. Um, not doing anything today, just kind of taking it easy. I ain't gonna lie, I've been snacking a lot, but it's been like fruit and it's just like a whole lot of snacking. But I should probably make some type of like dinner. I don't know. I probably won't though. Because like I said... I don't feel like doing anything. Nothing. No Nathan. Um. So, yeah. Today's a boring day. I literally stayed in the house and did nothing. I didn't even clean. I didn't fold. I just chilled. 
I watched, um, not Game of Thrones, what is it? House of Dragon. Murdered that. Went through all of the available episodes. That rolled me into true blood. I don't know how. I was in the HBO app and I was like, oh. True blood. But anywho, y'all. Not much to say. I ain't doing nothing. I ain't going nowhere. I have pulled up all this trash to take. Wow. Didn't even do that. I just didn't want to do anything. Didn't feel like getting cute. Nothing. So let's see where we text us. That's how we follow. That's how we follow. That's how we follow.